the transcription will start after 5 seconds sir the honorable finance minister has told us why he has thought fit to bring these finance bills in the middle of the year stop the plan contemplated a tax of about rupees 400 crores and now that the finance minister does not want to take recourse to deficit financing naturally the tax has got to be increased and it now comes to about rupees 1300 crores star therefore money must come from wherever it can be had and some sort of tax has to be imposed stop now the proposals have to be examined from that point of view stop some people have acclaimed the proposals as very necessary and well considered while others have found ground for criticizing them stop whatever may be the taxation measures if they are applied properly and with sympathy even measures which are not liked can be made to be appreciated and less objected to stop i have no doubt as the finance minister himself said that he will see that the measures are sympathetically administered and if that is done most of the objections that might be and have been put forward to the proposals would be removed stop as you may remember when the five year plan was discussed in this house and in the other house some of the members felt that perhaps a very optimistic view might have been taken of the resources that may be available for carrying out the five year plan stop even now people feel that the plan has got to be implemented and a lot depends on the implementation of the plan but the question is have be taken note correctly of the resources that are available and have we not overestimated and taken rather an optimistic view stop but implementation of the plan will not be 
very much affected if instead of five years a few more months are taken to implement it stop what i mean to say is if the resources are not sufficient to carry out the plan in five years there is no harm in increasing the period by a few months so that there may not be a very heavy strain on our resources and so that things may not go wrong on account of the heavy strain that may be put there on stop another thing that can be looked into very conveniently is whether or not a certain amount of savings can be affected stop so far as the proposals in the two bills are concerned i have one or two suggestions to make stop one is as regards the capital gains tax stop most of the exemptions that were in the previous act have been removed but i feel that so far as capital gains in respect of compulsory acquisition by government is concerned that should still continue to be exempted stop when a person sells his capital asset and makes a gain which is called an earned profit he may be taxed and perhaps he will have no justification in raising any objection stop but when a property is acquired which he does not want to sell but which is acquired under compulsion at the instance of the government for the use of the government in the case of such a compulsory acquisition there is no real justification for making the man pay capital gains tax also especially when he never wanted to part with his property and in fact he objected there too but had to part with it because the authorities wanted him to do that stop that is one small suggestion so far as capital gains tax is concerned and i think in a case where compulsory acquisition takes place it is for the government to consider whether or not they will think of giving relief 
to the unfortunate person who may have to part with his property in spite of himself stop another suggestion that i have to make is that so far as compulsory deposit is concerned the people who are conservative and who have put in careful and prudent management and have built up resources generally use them for the purpose of increasing the volume of business and stabilizing the position of the company but here the position is just as if you are going to penalize those companies which have prudently managed which have been managed in a conservative manner and which have not frittered away their resources stock some consideration should be shown to such companies that have built up resources and have utilized them in expanding their business so that they may not be called upon to put in these compulsory deposits stop otherwise wasteful expenditure will be encouraged and the management which have not been taking proper care for conserving their resources will get a premium stop then my friend said that equity shares had increased in value to the extent of 150 times depending on the number of years stop here the dividend that is going to be taxed is on the basis of the paid up capital which does not take into account the reserves built up over a number of years stop